back to yet another video. Video. A video. Video. A hey, y'all, welcome back to yet another video. If you are new, my name is Avril, and this is Home with a Naturally Stuck. All right, y'all, so you might be like, why are you sitting in front of your fireplace? I have a few things a few home decor stuff that I wanted to go ahead and show you and some of them are heavy and I'm afraid that when I pick them up if I'm sitting on a chair that it's gonna fall and I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep them all I do plan on doing some DIYs with some of the um, pieces that I did pick up they are a mix of home goods as well as TJ Maxx um, as well as yeah I think they're actually all home goods I have some stuff that's supposed to be coming in the mail from Amazon as well as Wayfair and I'm really excited so I will base it I will definitely obviously keep you guys up to date with that but I am in the midst of feeling like I want my house to look a bit more modern restoration warehouse crate and barrel kind of feel um, even CB2 like I love the look of like modern day decor so I'm really on the hunt for a lot of things as well as the fact that I've been watching a lot of YouTube more than usual and I've realized that I've missed out on a lot of pieces because I didn't realize I can spray paint stuff like what what hello where, where, where have I been so I went ahead and stopped at Target I actually have been looking for the matte spray paint um and i haven't been able to find it in any of the home depots any of the lows they do have it on amazon but it was like 19 dollars. the one that um diy with kb her channel is amazing the one that she has that she always uses is 19 dollars on amazon but i went ahead and went to target yesterday looking for something completely different and bumped into this so i actually found this it is the matte black um spray paint so i do have a few pieces here that you're probably going to be like okay that's not in your color scheme because basically um i will go ahead and try to input a footage of how my house is coming together of the look or maybe even some pinterest looks that just kind of give you the idea of where i'm going with it but i have grays i have black and white and i have some silver and a touch of gold it might sound like a lot but trust me it's not <laughs> So um, I went ahead and got this, so I'll definitely be recording some videos when I do go ahead and um, spray paint some stuff to change the color. So one of the things so far that I have picked up, and I picked it up from Home Goods yesterday for $16.99 is this vase. Really, really pretty. It's actually like a sage color. Really nice. I love the shape of it, and this is like perfect, I feel like, for actually above the fireplace or even on our entryway table so I do like this color however because I told you it can actually be a pop of color but in my case I would prefer it to be either black or white I have not been able to get the matte white yet but because of the texture of it I feel like you can um, I will be able to go ahead and paint it Dude, I couldn't pass it up when I seen because I've been trying to get some vases from um, the McGee line and Target, and every time I see everyone else posting it, everyone else Target is doing awesome with their stock, and mine is like the. So the next piece that I did get from the McGee line is actually this vase right here. I know it's very popular; a lot of people had it on um, here on YouTube, and this was only twenty dollars. So I actually have this currently on my. Um, a coffee table in the living room and just with the little greenery in there so it's really really cute and for $20 couldn't beat it another piece that I picked up that I really really like that helped to just go with the flow of what I'm trying to do in the living room right now is this little piece here this is actually in home goods and I actually got it for $7.99 it's really really cute and it's just a little cute statement piece that you could go ahead and put it on your side table. You could go ahead and put it on your coffee table. You can put it on your entryway table on top of a stack of books. So many great things you can do with it. And for $7.99, I picked it up so fast, y'all. All right, y'all. So I also have a cute bowl. Guys, this thing is so heavy. I mean heavy, okay? This beauty, I 
actually got from Home Goods. It has like that gray glossy paint and is marble. And I only got it for $19.99, y'all. Look at the shape of it. It's really, really cute, y'all. When I tell you, it's so heavy. Oh my gosh. For $19.99, I was like, mind you, it was the only thing on the shelf. Um, my home goods was, I guess they were going to get shipment, so they were low on a lot of things. And this was just sitting there, and I'm like, what? And it's saying that it's made in Indonesia, but it's such a very nice, rich-looking bowl to me. I could not pass it up. All right, y'all, so the next thing I did pick up recently, I did pick this up from, um, I believe it was Home Goods. This was $16.99. Just the cute little black and white box that you can just basically use as a um statement piece on the coffee table on the entryway table just the same really really cute it has the cute little gold so like it definitely has that modern day look to it pick that up and this was $16.99 y'all really? I actually went to home goods yesterday and what I started doing I'm like you know what I'm gonna go ahead and pass through every day it is on my way home doesn't just to see because I don't feel like they get a lot of stock when they do when they do get shipment It's not a lot. So you kind of have to just play around with it So I went ahead and actually seen this cute tray. It is it has that um cement um, kind of feel which is very restoration hardware to me. This was actually only $12.99 y'all and it has the silver handles on either side which is really, really cute. I can actually use this right on our, um, I can actually use this on a coffee table, entryway table, even the dining room table. Um, but it's really, really cute and I like it. Very heavy. And as, as I said, for $12.99, I could not go wrong, y'all. But this vase was very, very nice, y'all. I really, really like it. I actually like the color that it is, which is kind of like a grayish rustic look. Um, it's really nice. I love the shape of it. Um, this was only $19.99 from Home Goods, but the thing is, I'm not sure where I'm going to put it yet. As well as, the, so depending on where I put it, um, will determine the color that I need it to be. Um, so I'm not sure if I'm going to keep it. I love the shape of it though, and I just think it's a very antique looking piece. And for $19.99, you already know why I picked it up. <laughs> All right, y'all, so I also went ahead and picked up this beauty right here. Um, it's super heavy. It is the younger version um, of a lot of these pieces that I usually see, like that Roman look, um, as well as the female one I picked up, y'all. So I picked her up. Honestly, I'm going to keep it this look for now until I, I'm just gonna play around with it and see if it's something that I do need to spray paint black or I could keep one um, the color it is and then do the other one black or actually spray paint them more of a matte white because this kind of has like that stone grayish look. Um, but I'm also not sure if I'm gonna keep them only because it's like the kids in the Roman family which is not what I really like. It's not like that Zeus look or whatever like that. But it is different. Um, these two were only literally $12.99 each. And they were the only ones left. So I picked it up. The reason I really picked up the woman, the lady, the young girl, <laughs> is because she's the one that had the price. And the boy doesn't. So I picked the girl up. And I was like, you know what? Let's just take both. So I went ahead. Um, before I get to the books, I went ahead and picked up also. This is such a crate and barrel kind of bowl. I really, really wanted. Um, it is the shinier type, which is not that concrete looking stone wash like Restoration Hardware. But I actually like it because it just gives that extra touch to my living room. And this was only $16.99, y'all. And I had to go ahead and pick it up. You can actually use it as literally like a fruit bowl or stuff like that. But of course, I'm using it on my entryway table. And then I go ahead and just put some beads in it and have it hanging out. But it's really, really cute. And I'll be sure to go ahead and show you guys how I style it. And for $16.99, you know I picked it up. Okay. All right, y'all. So another piece that I did go ahead and pick up 
are these faux logs y'all i actually got these from crate and barrel really really cute i actually picked up two sets one set is actually in the fireplace and then i have these sitting outside just to kind of give the warmth look of the fireplace i have to say we have not used the fireplace yet and it's been two years but i wanted it to just feel a bit homey and cozy so these are actually really really perfect they were actually only twenty dollars y'all so go ahead and check out your local or online at crate and barrel because for twenty dollars you already know I actually also picked up a few more pieces from home goods in the sales section i actually found this beauty right here and believe it or not this is actually in crate and barrel i will go ahead and input a picture that it is very similar the color is not the same so i might actually spray paint this black not sure yet because as i said i do have a touch of gold in the house but depending on where i place it then it's going to determine and y'all this was only nine dollars it had the red tick the direct sticker i was like what's wrong with it picked it up so fast really 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 cute it is metal and it is has that texture that i can actually change the color a few times depending on what i want which is really really good very light um because it's like very i, I it probably should have been nine dollars from the beginning but i do know restoration hardware definitely has similar pieces like moi y'all so this piece i actually found in home goods as well this has like that wood texture um and the circle shape with the black piece um i actually only got this piece y'all for twenty dollars y'all twenty dollars this is like literally in home goods it's literally in crate and barrel i've seen it at restoration hardware as well and they sell it i think as a set so i'll go ahead and input a picture there um but once i seen it i picked it up so fast and did i say i got it for 19 99 y'all all right y'all so last but not least i did go ahead and pick up this decor book right here remodelista i'm pretty sure you guys have seen it tons of times a lot of people have it it was only 19.99 and i should have actually picked up two because i do want one for um another table that's in the house um but it's really really cute the looks in here are actually really nice other than the outside that goes with the modern look of the house that i'm trying to go with i actually love the ideas that they have in here and it definitely gives you great ideas of how to just remodel your house which is something i'm doing hello well not remodeling um meaning changing cabinets and stuff like that but definitely remodeling in in terms of painting over things and of such so this is a really cute book it was 19.99 and i'm gonna go ahead and go get another one um i don't know why i didn't pick up two and then i went ahead and picked up this chanel book that was only 19.99 as well and on the side the writing on the side is black and white so it helps to just kind of go with the look as well but this book is actually just about like the different tailoring and things of that sort the prints and stuff of chanel um and the picture and the pictures are inside are, ugh, the pictures inside are like sketched so it's really cute but i really bought it for the outside y'all so i ain't gonna lie um but yeah so these are the two decor books i did actually order my louis vuitton book and my tom ford book y'all so i'm waiting for those to come so i'll be sure to update you with that in another video but for the most part i think i'm done i think i showed you guys all that i'm gonna all that i purchased within the past two weeks um and i would definitely go ahead and show you guys the updated looks of where i put everything if you are not yet following me on instagram y'all go ahead and follow me on instagram because that's a great place to go ahead and just keep up to date because i post a lot more on there of course regarding some home decor and things of that sort so go ahead and follow me on there y'all and i will definitely keep you up to date in the next video but thank you guys so much for checking me out and i will see you in the next one peace